Hey, Danny Sparrow, Danny Sparrow, Danny Sparrow. Woo! <laughs> no, wait, wait. Stop, stop. <laughs> okay, okay. Ooh. Go, girl. Hello, guys. My name is Nana. I'm from Denmark. It's a very cool place. You should go there. No, it's pretty boring, but that doesn't matter. Today, I'm gonna do the um, Danish bear. This is my first time making the Danish bear. Okay, Danish bear, Danish bear, Danish bear. Woo! <laughs> okay, guys, so I'm from the smallest village in the whole world, and we always drink one drink at the same bar, and it's a Danish bear drink. It's really good. It's a good drink. Yeah, so we only have this one drink, so every one of you should go to the bar and have like a little sip. It's a great drink. You're gonna love it. Go there. It's a fantastic place. <laughs> Okay guys, so let's make this drink. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Let me know in the comments if you like the drink or if you want to try it out. It's delicious. Okay, so first step is to choose the perfect glass for my drink. So there's a lot of cool glasses here, but I want to choose the best of the best. We have like different options here. These ones, like these ones. These ones are way too small. I'm gonna use that. This one is too small too. So we're gonna use this one for today. Alcohol is good. Good for your health. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, it's just good. <laughs> okay, so in the bar, I saw that people, the bartenders, are shaking the drinks. I've never tried it, so uh, I'm gonna try it today. Shake the drink, yeah? <laughs> well, let's see what we got. So we have uh, this thing, I don't know, and another shaker. This one is more fancy looking. This one, American black. And the last one, this one we got here. All of them. So I think this one looks cool. I'm gonna use this one. <laughs> this one is more fancy looking. I don't like these ones. They look, this one looks ugly. So, mm. yeah, and it's not a Danish flag, so I'm not gonna use this one. Okay, so we don't need those. Just gonna put it away. <laughs> okay, so the main ingredient is gin. Got this right here. And gin is actually my favorite liqueur. This is the Gordon original, the original Gordon's London Dry Gin. It's it's gonna be fine. It's gonna work out. So this is this is good. Just use the Gordon's. Okay, guys, let's pour the gin in the shaker thing. So taking the gin, the lid off, and we're just gonna pour a lot of this. Yeah, yeah, that's enough. So I usually do more, but we're gonna stay a bit sober today, so this is fine for today. And don't forget that gin is really good for your health, so drink. So we're gonna put this back. The next ingredient is lime, and it's it's really good and fresh in this drink, so that's why I like it. I brought this fresh Danish lime from Denmark, so now we're gonna use it in the drink. Lime board, lime, and a knife. So now we're cutting the lime to squeeze the fresh Danish lime juice. Yeah, like this. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Okay, so for squeezing the lime, I have this uh, cool thing. I don't know what it's called, but it's, it will squeeze the lime. So in Danish, we call this citron pasta. It's really handy. Okay, so I'm going to squeeze the lime. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Next one. Yeah, we're gonna do two. We're gonna do two. One more time. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> so the most important part is sugar. Of course, we need sugar and it's over here somewhere. I'm just gonna shake it first. Shake it a little bit. Let's pour. That's enough. <laughs> so normally I pour way more gin than sugar, but today we're doing like one and one. It's the same, same amount. Okay, so we don't need this anymore. We're just gonna put it here. Okay, so boys and girls, it's ice time because Denmark is really cold, so we want the drink to be cold. Ice, ice, baby. <laughs> okay, so in Denmark, we would usually use this much ice, but I don't think it will fit in this shaker. So we're just gonna put in as much as we can, okay? Ooh, okay, okay. Ooh, go, girl. That's enough. Okay, so I'm just gonna clean this up because it's a little messy, and normally I don't... I don't buy my drink looking like this, so yeah. Let's put this on top. Yeah, it is ready to go. So I'm gonna shake now. <laughs> Are you guys ready? Okay, let's go. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> don't forget to give me a like for the shaking. <laughs> Okay, so the coolest thing about this drink is the red color and it's we're gonna do it like from raspberry So we're gonna put some raspberry in the bottom. Let's do it 
Just gonna taste a little bit. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Raspberries. I'm gonna put this back and we're gonna add more ice to the glass because I like ice. Okay, let's go. Ooh. Yeah, that's good. Put this away. So now the drink is almost ready to go. Just gonna get this lid off. Yeah. We have different tools here. I'm gonna use this one. Okay, so I'm actually really nervous because I've never done this drink before, but we'll see. I'm gonna pour it now. Not to the top because I'm gonna add a bit of lemonade. Yeah, that's good. Good, looks pretty. It looks so cool actually, it's really pretty. Really, I'm a good, I'm a good bartender. Okay, I got some good lemonade down here in the fridge. It's the expensive one, you know? I'm just gonna pour a little bit of that on top. Oh, okay, yeah, that's good, that's good. Okay, so I'm gonna clean everything up now. This is the reason why the drink is called Danish bear. Um, I'm gonna use some gummy bears because in Denmark, apparently, my oh, favorite yeah. candy is gummy bears. So I'm gonna use that to garnish. <laughs> gummy bears! <laughs> I had a few gummy bears in my bag from, um, they're really old, but uh, we're just gonna use them anyway. They're really hot uh, because they're so old, but they're gonna go in the drink anyways. <laughs> so now we're gonna cool them down down because yeah they need it so just like oh my boy <laughs> it's gonna put a few like the red ones they're, they're cute they're pretty I'm gonna put them here i don't like the black ones we're gonna use the yellow ones and the red ones that's enough <laughs> no actually we're gonna put a lot more but i'm just gonna put the black ones away here we go Oops. so only the yellow ones the red ones gonna go in the drink wait oh my god yeah here we go <laughs> okay i'm just gonna smell it it doesn't really yeah it smells like it smells like bear i don't have to i'm a teddy bear definitely a bit of gummy bears yeah it's it's a drink it's a good it's a good one <laughs> and now i'm just gonna taste it so i'm gonna grab a straw so i like this straw it's it's a good metal one i'm gonna taste it wait i'm just gonna stir it a little bit okay Ugh, too much ice <laughs> okay Let's taste. <laughs> so it doesn't taste anything like the drink I had at home, <laughs> but it's good. It's a uh, very raspberry. It's good. So maybe they were using like Danish raspberries, but this drink is cool. It tastes good and I like raspberries. So and gin too. I could put a little bit of gin in. That would be much better. Yeah. So um, I like how the gin and raspberry goes together and the gummy bears. They're making everything better, so you should try this drink. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and like the shake. And uh, see you in Denmark.